When running a research project, it's really hard to keep track of all of your notes. Just think of it, in a PhD, you might go over 2,000 journal papers. That's a lot, and if you're trying to use binders, it's really not gonna work very well. So Mendeley is a solution to how you keep track of all your notes from the papers, and what's more, make them searchable. So here I have Mendeley desktop, and I've got a whole load of papers from a conference that I just attended. So I'm gonna pick one at random, and this is actually one which I wrote, which is not a boy scanner measurement, are valid for pattern construction. And that's my name right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on the file attached. And if you don't know how to attach a file to a PDF, um, attach a file to a Mendeley file, then click on the link below. There's a video telling you how to do that. So anyway, I've got my journal paper here and I'm gonna read through and I'm gonna see some very interesting things. So here I've got um, reference. Analysis of pattern drafting methods has been undertaken to determine ease, understand theories incorporating the process, and even show how the approaches can better recognize the individual shape, size, and proportions used in the process. Now, let's assume that that's really interesting for my work. So I'm gonna go ahead here and click on the highlight button, and that's gonna make it nice and easy to find. So if I close that and then go forward a year or five years, wherever long it is, reopen it, my highlights are still there. I never lose them. I can do more. I can click on the note button and I can add a note. So this is really useful for my project on body shape and clothing design. And just like any um, thing else, I can move the note to the side. And if I close this down, open it up a year's time, it's still gonna be there. If I click on this tab here, say notes, you can see that the notes I've made, so the one I just made is visible there. So I can go through my paper, making notes, adding ideas, telling what it's about, using highlights, and have everything look, um, saved there for all time. As long as I've got the journal paper, which is forever, it's there. Now, if I click on the search button, click on the actual um, magnifying glass, I can click on notes. So let's have a look, um, clothing design. So clothing. Ah, so the reason why I've got um, no difference here is that I've got to do something slightly different. So let's just click on close. Go back to my paper, which I just um, edited. So when you search in notes, it searches in the general notes. So I'm now putting here clothing design as a tag I can close the paper, click magnifying glass, and notes, clothing, you'll see that the paper is there. So when you want to search in a note, make it searchable, use general notes. This is a really good place to put ideas saying this whole paper relates to the theme of motivation, or clothing design, or UX, or virtual reality, whatever it is. And then your notes on the actual paper, they're not searchable by the main area, but they're viewable here. So that's a really quick overview of how to use um, the notes taking in Mendeley. I hope you use it, I hope you find it great use. Any questions about knowing more, click on the comments below and leave me a note. See you later on.